Hamtech, welcome to my gadget channel. We've been looking at the Meshtastic system off grid network. This one works, it's the Heltec version three. It's the one that most people are getting. We've added a battery as you can see. And if I go out and about, or if I get it up high, we start to receive messages off grid. No internet, no, no anything required, 4G, 3G, and we get messages. How cool is that? So this one does not have GPS, although you can add a module to this to give it GPS. I'll show you a separate video on that. But at the moment, we've got this one. Now we've got lots of different Heltec units coming and LoRa units. And if, if you want to know what LoRa stands for, it's for long range. It's the radio part of, this, of these devices. So you have the ESP32 board uh, and then you have the radio part. Now, if we turn this one over, it has two two items or two modules here one is for gps and one is the radio and we're buying the ones that cover 868 megahertz and it's really really easy and quick to load the firmware on this so i'm going to do that in another video i'll just show you where the firmware link is and then we'll uh in the next video you'll see me loading this and using this and i really recommend that once you have loaded these get yourself a battery yeah uh, and also i mean they are they do have a if you look here, USB, trying to focus that, USB-C. And if you look on the back, you've got your place where you can plug in your battery. The kit came with my power connector, which is nice and easy for connecting a battery. And also this, this one unusually came with an antenna, SMA to antenna. So what you do is on the actual unit, there's a small little connector. Oh, there's actually two. So one is for the GPS antenna, which um, did not come. <laughs> so we're going to need that. Uh, and the other one is the LoRa unit. It says LoRa there for long range. Now, hopefully there's a built-in uh, GPS. We're going to be finding out that one very quickly. Uh, but I'll get myself. I've got a connector. and I've got an SMA um, spare. Ah, that's what this is, I guess. Right, I've just realised. We just need two of these, actually. We need... And adapt, sorry, my hand's in the way there. Two of these, very hard to make it focus on this. So on the, but the lower item is the IPEX connector that goes on the board. And then you've got your SMA where we can connect an antenna of the right type for GPS. Just goes here and the connector on the board. You just saw that there. So we're going to give all this a go and just show you that program that Meshtastic provide for free for easy firmware loading. So look here, I literally just go to this link, it's in the description, drop down, go to the one I've got is the wireless tracker version one, select the firmware. So I just, I just always select the one at the top, uh, which says stable and you've got alpha. Does that mean it's a test one? Someone let me know. And then click flash, and I'm going to do that in a minute. Bye for now. 73.